One day I walked into the real estate agent's office and he showed me the options available and I saw this one which had a lot of light, a lot of windows and it was the perfect shape and size. So I went ahead and, and signed the contract and three years later the building was completed. Uh, it was a dream for quite some time and slowly became a reality and it slowly sank in. I think when I took the first step into the apartment things started getting real and it was really exciting. Yeah, my situation was very complex because I was overseas for several months at the time and settlement had been pushed beyond what I had hoped it would be. Uh, and so I was earning a foreign income and that made things very difficult with lenders, um, even though my income was a lot uh, higher than what I would earn in Australia. Banks were not willing to lend um, you know, the full amount. It was kind of tricky, as well as knowing what bank to go with, given my circumstances, um, it, it was going to be a, a nightmare to try and work out on my own. And at the time I wasn't too sure whether I was going to go with you guys or not, but I think one thing that definitely appealed from the very start was the more personal level of service. Um, I felt that you knew about the property a lot more than many of the other mortgage brokers and that you could give me a more specific type of service. Would I recommend Michaela and Entourage to my friends and people working overseas? Certainly, definitely. I think it's saved me a lot of hassle in trying to scour all the different banks available, in trying to sort out my loan, and just having someone who knows the system and who knows the different options that, was, that were available to me was something that just saved me months and months of hassle and work. As for whether I want to you know, buy another home, I think that's on the cards, but much later on in life. Will it be in Melbourne? Maybe. Given my travels, I'm, I'm thinking it could just as well be somewhere else in the world, but let's see what happens. Who knows what life can bring.